friends, welcome to another edition of Terry Young Outdoors. Uh, we're heading on a little uh, two-night backpacking trip over in the Sipsi Wilderness. Have you been to the Sipsi Wilderness? Have you backpacked in the Sipsi Wilderness? If you have, leave a comment below. Let me know about your favorite part of the Sipsi Wilderness. Right, guys I'm here at the uh, Thompson Trailhead uh, as you can see there's quite a few vehicles here there's room for probably uh, maybe nine or ten vehicles in here so there's Brad with what's the up flies hiking how's it going let's, let's uh, head out in the Sipsy yep we're gonna do a little Sipsy here and uh, Senior Hiker 77, uh, or Power, Power Bill, Bill, Power Bill, and uh, Keith uh, Squidley are ahead of us. And Max from Caveman. Oh, Caveman OS. OS. Gotcha. Yeah, Caveman OS is with us as well. Oh, cool. So, yep, got some cool guys with us, and so we're gonna get into the uh, Sipsy Wilderness here, and we'll see you on down the trail. So I take a little shortcut. We're gonna go through the eye of the needle up here, which should cut a little mileage off of our uh, our uh, trek to get back to the other guys. Yeah, we've been doing some slipping and sliding, so if you're out on these trails, be careful of uh, a big pile of leaves on top of a rock with moss on it, because it's like going ice skating. If you hear me breathing hard, I'm not breathing hard. <laughs> not, that not that my cardio is not great right now. Maybe this wasn't worth it. <laughs> <laughs> These tall packs. Okay. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm leaving the camera going, so this should be really interesting. <laughs> I think I'm stuck. Okay. Ooh. All right, we made it. Here comes Terry. Yeah, kind of crazy. Had to take the pack off to get through there. guys uh, that's gonna end day one uh, I know the lighting's not real good in here but uh, I'm just using my headlamp as a uh, light but uh, 
kind of an eventful day. So, um, Crow and I ended up with uh, a little over 15 miles today. Uh, not, I wasn't really intending to do 15 miles, but we ended up doing it anyway. So, anyway, it was a fun day. Um, like I said, I got a lot more, a lot more mileage than I thought I was going to get. But uh, that'll put a wrap on day one tomorrow. I'll do a lot more filming. Uh, so come join me tomorrow for tonight. I'm going to uh, get it some rest. So I'll see you in the morning. So here we are, day two in the Sipsy Wilderness. It's 6.40 in the morning. Uh, it started raining about 1.30 and it's been raining ever since. So we're going to just kind of hang out in the tent for a little while and let, wait for it to slow down and get up and uh, get dressed have some breakfast and make our way out well not out make our way on to our next camp so welcome to day two in the Sipsy wilderness well it's around uh, 7 30 in the morning and uh still raining so had breakfast here in the tent and we're gonna get out of our tents as soon as it stops raining we're gonna get out of our tents and pack our tent up and we're gonna be out of here but for right now we're just chilling out uh, the guys are over there under the tarp talking so I'm just putting my stuff together uh, getting ready to get out of here so probably within the next hour hour and a half we'll be uh, be on the move I think we're gonna do about six miles today to our next camp so see you shortly all right, going down to, uh, we're breaking down camp right now, and uh, I'm going down to get some water. So I'm gonna filter some water in my uh, Catadine Be Free. So I better stop filming or I'll be sliding all the way down to the river. Catadine be free. Got my water in the bag. Drop the be free into it. Screw it on. I got the sport cap on the be free. So I'll just start filtering the water into my smart water bottles. As you can see, the flow rate, the flow rate on the Bee Free is uh, quite a bit better than the Sawyer Squeeze. As you can see, I'm just squeezing it out of the uh, Canock bag through the Catadine Bee Free water filter and into the smart water bottle that I'll have on my pack. And we're going to have water pretty much the whole way today, so I'm, I'm not going to fill my bottle completely up. But that's how you filter water. Oh yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it is. I do that frequently. Yeah, that. Just do a screenshot because I can't get a still photo of myself up on something like this. All right, so I'll let's just do that. I wonder if I could. I hold it for you. Let me hold it for you. No, no, no. Um, I want us all to get in it. Oh, oh, okay. Fire! Turn me on. Back to burn it. Back to burn. Never have a minute of it. Never have a minute of it. All 
the way! In the face! Alright. Did you get the... Here we are at the big tree. Smile, yeah, everybody. John said he's got bigger trees in his backyard. He's not impressed. <laughs> that is one big tree for sure. Yeah, this is a three year odyssey to get. They're claiming this is a big tree, but I, I don't think so. There's one a little bigger than this around the corner, right? No. Three year odyssey. And you got to earn your right to come here and touch this tree. They brought me down a, there wasn't even a trail. It's, it's not on the map. Bushwhacked in here, uphill, whole, oh, out of breath, everything. Terrible. But this is check off the bucket list. Well, they say this is the biggest tree in Alabama right here. But it's going to be no match for the silky. Watch how easily this will go through. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and away I come with the cuffs on. <laughs> to find you something you can solve. Oh, yeah, that good enough. That good. Okay. I don't think I've introduced everybody. Max, uh, what's what's your channel name again? Uh, Caveman OS Hiking. Caveman OS Hiking. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, he's from Nashville, Tennessee. Check out his channel. All right, so this is B Falls. B Branch Falls, I think. As you can see. All right, I just walked up to the, not really top, but towards the top. Get a little better view of Bee Falls. Okay, guys, we had lunch at the big tree here in Bee Falls, and pan around, there's Big Tree. And behind me is uh, Bee Falls, and we are, we had lunch and we're moving out. We're going to go to the top and, uh, Finest place to camp. 
it go, Terry. Let's hey, thank you, thank you. I couldn't get the big tree down, so I decided to get this big tree. Yeah, that'll be big enough. And then with all these plants, we have the, the one outlier here. Yeah, I'm done with the big tree now. Yeah, that's, that's all. Yeah. And and the, and honestly, the big tree is probably the hardest thing out here to get to. Really? Yeah. The, the rest of it is is reasonably easy. Yeah, Brad said there was no hills. Didn't know about all that blowdown. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, yeah, the blowdowns in B branch, it's, that's rough. All right, guys, that's going to put a wrap on day two. We just finished dinner. Uh, I had the uh, Peak uh, Chicken Pesto Pasta from Peak. It was really good. I love it. That's one of my favorites from Peak. Uh, so, yeah, we got to see some cool stuff today. Went to uh, the Big Tree, uh, B Falls. That was awesome. Senior hiker on his bucket list was seeing the Big Tree, so it was kind of cool to take him to see it. So we'll get up in the morning, have breakfast, and uh, hike about three miles back to our vehicles. So it's a great day. Thank you for joining me, and uh, we'll see you in the morning for day three. Well, it's day three in the Sipsy Wilderness. Um, just woke up. I actually, I woke up about ten times last night because my sleeping pad got a hole in it. So. It deflated about uh, eight or ten times so I had to reinflate it try to get a little sleep do that over and over again so I didn't get a good night's sleep last night but I'm getting up and gonna eat some breakfast pack up and we're gonna head out so welcome to day three of the Sipsy Wilderness all right, we are wrapped up with breakfast and uh, starting to pack up to get out of here. Max is over putting his uh, hammock system away. And I know he enjoyed that hammock system a lot better than I did last night. <coughs> so, yeah, we're going to pack up and uh, ease on out of here. I think it's, what, about uh, 15, 16 miles out? Is that yeah, about right? 20. Yeah, a little bit of, it's probably, you know, 3,000 feet of climb and uh, we'll be out of here. So, we're going to start getting everything together. Last day at the Sipsy Wilderness. Uh, so we're going to get on out of here. Thanks for joining me, and we'll see you at the trailhead. Bye. 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 Give me a call if you really decide you're going to do that. <laughs> Yeah. Throw it off in the woods. <laughs> I'm thinking that's it more. I just don't want to take off much time to work, so I think that's what I'm going to do. I found out how wrong he was. <laughs> Making it pretty good. The uh, trail's been pretty pretty flat from uh, camp, so had one decent climb. So we should be uh, the car maybe uh, <laughs> half hour, something like that, maybe three hours. We got another 25 <laughs> miles, Terry. What are you talking about? 25 miles, something like that. I got to keep up my appearance. That's right. Fall that's right. Hill. I think there's a, a, a small 2,000 foot climb between here and the car, but as false as my appearance is, we got to keep it up. <laughs> that's right. All right, see you at the trailhead. All right, guys, that's going to close another edition of uh, Terry Young Outdoors, and I want to thank these guys for bringing me out here to the to the Sipsy Wilderness. Uh, it was my first time out here, but it definitely won't be the last. Mad Max with uh, Caveman OS Hikes. He hiking. hiking, yep. Okay. Uh, senior Hiker 77. Enjoyed being out here with you, Senior. Yeah. Enjoyed thanks. watching you well, get to see nice, the big tree. Nice meeting you for the second time. For the second time. Squidly, uh, gone feral with Squidly. And Crow, uh, appreciate as Crow that. flies hiking. And uh, Pyro Bell, who is going to start putting some videos on YouTube. Yes. <laughs> so expect to see <laughs> all you that soon. fascinating footage I took. That's right. So, <laughs> all right, guys. Yeah, that's going to do it. Check out these guys' channels. Uh, they're great channels. So we will see you on the next adventure. Thanks for tuning in. If you're not a subscriber, consider being a subscriber. Uh, like and comment on the video, and we'll see you on the next one.